For today's video, we rescued over 6,500 baby chickens from being slaughtered. Here, we're just gonna kinda spread it on out. We're just gonna spread it. Each box is full of chickens. Let's open it up in three, two, one. We have our first casualty. This guy passed away. There's literally hundreds of chicks in here. What is up everyone and welcome back to the channel. I hope all of you guys are having just an absolutely amazing day. Now for today's video, well, for today's video, we rescued over 6,500 baby chickens from being slaughtered. Mario from ZWF gave me a call yesterday and he said, hey Jacob, I just had someone drop off 6,500 chickens. And I said, well, why did they give you 6,500 chickens? Well, Mario told me that these chicks came from Canada, they were flown to Miami, and they were supposed to get on a plane to go to Mexico. For some reason or another, they didn't make it on the plane, and well, the chicks were going to be left to die. The people were just gonna leave them, let them die, but they called ZWF and said, hey, can you guys help out? If you guys want them, you can have them. By the time we get the chicks to you, they're gonna be dead. So Mario said, well, bring them over here, and when they got here, well, all of them were alive. So I went over there, I picked up a ton of these chicks, I have them here, I set them up, and well guys, you are not going to want to miss today's rescue. So guys, if you want to see us save over 6,000 baby chickens from being slaughtered, well guys, you are in the right place, and well, we're going to hop right into that. So I just got back from ZWF, I just picked up chicks. Now, I don't know how many of these rescue chicks I have, all I know is it was like boxes upon boxes. I'm gonna roll the video right now on the screen so you guys can see and hear how many chicks there were. Now at this point, Mario had about 3,000 of the chicks, but in total, when he first got them, there was over 6,500. So Mario's been giving them out. I decided to take some. I took five boxes, four of them are mine, one box is for my sister, and each box has like 60 to 70 chicks. So we have a couple of hundred chicks. Now it's gonna be cold tonight. We gotta get them set up indoors. I'm gonna be, I may regret it, but I'm gonna be setting them up right here in the house. So we've got our towel, we've got a kiddie pool. We're gonna put the kiddie pool right here, and would you look at that, look. We've got our Turbo Ant bike here, absolutely amazing. I wanna give a special shout out again to Turbo Ant for sending me this bike, absolutely love it. So guys, without further ado, let's get our, let's get our pool. Oh, Zeus, you're blocking the door, buddy. So Mr. Zeus is right here, it's already a nighttime out. Wait, you can hear him in the back of my truck, you hear that? They're chirping. All right, we gotta get doing. We gotta get going quick before these chicks uh, before they die because it's cold out right now. So we're gonna get our kitty pool now. This literally happened out of the blue, so I was not prepared to literally have a couple of hundred chickens. So we're gonna make do with what we got overnight. But in the morning, we're gonna be setting them up properly. But I'm hoping we're gonna be able to fit the four boxes in here, guys. We'll see. So we've got our kitty pool in place right here. So what we've got to do now is well, I've got to get some pine shavings. I gotta get a water dish. A food dish and uh, we're gonna set them up. I've got to get those things so guys let me go grab them and I'll catch you back here. All right, all right, we are back here. We're back. I've got all of my supplies so we've got the supplies here to set these chicks up. We got to move quick so we've got our water dish now we got to fill this up with water. So we've got our water dish. We have our food. Now, I don't have any chick food right now I, because this happened last second. So for right now, we're actually going to use dog food. We're going to crush it up. So if any of you guys ever have any baby chicks and you happen to run out of chick food and you need it but you can't get to the store, well, you can use crushed up dog food for one day for a feeding or two and it won't really hurt them. So that's what we're going to be doing. And we have our substrate. So we have our pine shavings for them. So that's what we're going to do to get started. We're just going to take this big old thing of pine shavings right here. And we're just going to kind of spread it on out. We're just going to spread it right on in just like that. I think we have enough. We should have enough of these pine shavings. Would you look at that? We have our pine shavings. It's looking good. It's looking great. So we got our pine shavings in. Now all we've got to do is we got to crush this food and fill up the water dish. Okay, we've got our water dish. Now let's uh, fire it up and fill up. We're filling and okay, I think that's enough water. So we've got our water here. Now how we're gonna do this is we're just gonna slide this this way. We're not on, wait. Okay, we're on. Now we're just gonna kinda keep this just like that. I've got the water dish now. The only thing left to do is crush up the food. I've got the food. We've got our hammer. 
we've got our bag. So to do this, we're literally just gonna open this on up just like this. I'm gonna take the food, we're just gonna kinda get it right on in just like that. We did it, we got it. All right, we've got our food in here. Now we're just gonna close this on up. We don't wanna have any spillage, we're gonna get all the air out. So we're just gonna put this here and then we're just gonna slightly just start, you know, banging on it. One minute, 37 seconds later. All right, and I think we're good. So you saw the dog food. We got it all crushed up into like a fine little powder now. We've got our little tray right here. Now this is just an easy, quick way to feed your chickens if you don't have food. So we're just gonna kind of put that on here. We're gonna spread it out. Now we got a lot of chickens. We probably have over a couple hundred of them. So we're just gonna put some of this food on here. We've got our food. Now some of these bigger pieces, they're just not gonna eat them. They'll eat the fine pieces, but these bigger ones, they'll just leave and we'll grind it up later. Now that the food is ready, the water is ready. Well, all we've gotta do is put the food and water in and get these chickens set up. Okay, we're trying to balance right now. We're trying to slightly balance this. We've got our food and the water. We're gonna lower. Okay, we're going down. All right, and okay. We're good. We got it. We've got our food right here, so we're just literally going to take this food. I'm going to put the food right in the middle so we can surround it. So we're going to put our food here. We're going to spread out our bedding just a little more. So we've got our food here. We've got our water dish. Now, this is a little bit tricky. This thing is quite heavy. So I've got my water dish and... All right, the water dish is gonna go right here in the corner, right by the food. Now that our little chicken setup is ready, well now the moment all of you guys have been waiting for, we're gonna go in the truck, we're gonna get these chickens. It's really chilly out, so the chickens can't stay out. And I'm just so happy that I was able to save these chickens from being slaughtered. So guys, without further ado, I'm gonna go in the truck and grab our chickens. All right, we've got our last box right here, and there they are. So in here, we have our five boxes. We got one, two, three, four, five, and each box is full of chickens. Now again, the backstory behind these chickens are they were gonna be exported to somewhere. I think they were going to Mexico, but they weren't able to catch the flight. So these chickens were literally just gonna be dumped in slaughter. They were just gonna let them all die. But ZWF decided to take them in, decided to save them and find homes for them. So I decided to take five boxes. I'm gonna keep four. My sister's gonna keep a box. So guys, these chickens, I don't know when the last time they were fed. I don't know when the last time they had water was. So guys, let's get this on open. We're saving these thousands of chickens. Let's open this right now. Oh, that did not, this is, this is not working. All right, we got it off. Now guys, we're going to, uh, let's actually move this box down. The reveal you've been waiting for, there could be some dead chickens in here. I am not entirely sure. I have not even looked in here. I just went and picked them up. So guys, let's open it up in three, two, one. Oh my goodness, look at them. They are just so adorable. Look at all these cute chicks. So these are, I think, male chicks. I'm not sure, what does it say? I'm not even, I don't even know what they are, but guys, look at them. They're so adorable. How many do you guys think are in this box? There's one, two, three, I'm not even sure. There's just, oh my gosh, look how cute they are. Look how adorable these chicks are. So we've got this one box here. Now let's get the other boxes. So this one is definitely males and they're ruby and chicks. So let's kind of open this up right here. Guys, this is absolutely insane. I've never seen anything quite like this. I'm sure you guys haven't either. So we've got this other box right here. Now let's let's get this slide this box and you guys can just hear them chirping and going insane. So we've got this box. Oh my goodness, there's another box. All right, we're switching scissors. The other ones uh, were not the best, so we've got these guys here. Oh, we don't want that to go there, so we're gonna move that here. Let's open this box up, one, two. <gasps> oh my goodness, we have more little chickens, guys. This is insane. Okay, I believe actually these are my sister's chicks, so we're gonna keep these aside. The ones that have the little black chicks. Oh, look at you. You are so cute, look at you. Hey, buddy, come here, little black guy. Oh my goodness, look at him, he's, he's black and he's got the little yellow spots. This guy is adorable, look at this cute little chick. Hey buddy, how you doing? So Hannah's on her way right now to pick up these chicks. So these are gonna be Hannah's, so be sure to watch that on her channel. Now guys, to think that these chicks were literally just gonna be dumped and left for dead is just so incredibly sad. So let's take these guys out right here. We wanna be very gentle with them. Okay, let's move these guys right here. All right, we got them here. Now let's open up another box. Guys, this is like a mystery box. Now, good thing is, I don't see any dead chicks so far. So that is a great thing that we don't have any dead chicks, but let's open this one on up, one, two. And look, we don't have any dead chicks on this one. So this is a, a great sign. Let's kind of just slide these this way. 
This is a great sign so far, no dead chicks. That's exactly what we wanted. None of these guys to die, none of them to pass away. So we've got these here and we have a box of males. So let's open on up and we got our final box in three, two, one. Look at that guys, look how adorable they are. Now wait until, oh, oh, is this guy dead? Hey buddy, are you alive? Okay, he's definitely alive. But they're, oh, is this guy alive? Okay, wait. He's alive. Okay, that's great. Now, guys, when you see the full scope of this, let's get all these chicks uh, lined up right here. When I mean a lot of chicks, and when I mean hundreds, there is literally hundreds. No, 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 don't jump out of the box, buddy. So we literally have hundreds and hundreds of chicks right here. Look at this. Absolute insanity. And guys, to think that I could have literally gotten another 20, 30 boxes if I wanted, that is crazy to me that that could have happened. But I mean, I am unsure what, what we're gonna be doing with all of them. We're definitely gonna be giving away some to some of my friends. So uh, here they are guys. So this box is going to my sister. So we gotta get these guys set aside. You guys are gonna get help soon, but these are mine. All of these are somehow gonna fit in here. We're probably gonna have to do a different setup, but we're gonna put most of them in here. So guys, without further ado, let's get our rescue chicks in their new home. Oh no guys, I just noticed the tragedy right here. Look, I think we have our first, no. We have our first casualty. This guy passed away. Oh, I'm so sorry, buddy. So he passed away in there. And then I looked over here and noticed that this one has sadly passed away as well. Poor guy, oh my gosh, that is just so sad. And honestly guys, I think we might find a couple more in here because these guys especially are not looking too good. Oh, this one right here is missing all the feathers around his neck. That's not good right there. Oh, is he, is this guy all right? Okay, we're gonna put you in here first, buddy. Here, get some water. You need some much needed water. Here you go, buddy, you want some water? This guy's not looking too hot. Doesn't look like he's gonna make it. So guys, let's start getting these guys in. So we're just gonna kind of just pick them up just like this. We're just gonna put them in the kiddie pool. Hi guys, we're just, I'm here. I'm just trying to help you guys out. So we're just gonna kind of, we're gonna kind of just scoop them up. Just one, we're gonna scoop them up in little handfuls at a time. Get them in here. Come on guys, how you doing guys? This is absolutely insane. I have literally never seen this many in my life. We've got most of them in now. They're not gonna stay like this. I just put them in here so they could get out of the tiny boxes, but we still have a ton. Now those are for my sister. These are sadly uh, not looking like they're gonna make it. Like that one is done. Oh no. So it looks like several have died so far. There's one that, oh no. This guy is, is dying right here. Not sure uh, what we can do for him. But guys, look at this. There's literally hundreds of chicks in here. Now, a lot of them are actually eating. Most of them are actually eating. It's actually crazy that if you look, most of the food has actually already been eaten. You can see they're already munching down. They're chowing down. Now, sorry if you guys can't hear too well. It's literally so loud in here, full of chicks. Now, we're gonna go get some more bins and we're actually gonna be separating some of these out. We're not gonna keep this many in here because if we keep them all like this, well, they're gonna trample each other. They're gonna die. They're not gonna be able to get access to food and water, but you can see these guys are already munching away at the food. Look how adorable they are. They're munching away, they're doing well. So these guys look happy, they look healthy. But guys, comment down below right now. How many chicks do you think we have? I have no idea. There's gotta literally be like 70 of them just right here in this little section. Absolutely insane stuff right here, guys. So let me know down below um, how many you think are in here. The, these guys are sadly not looking too good. We're gonna be doing something with them. And well, that is going to end today's episode. I hope you guys did enjoy watching today's chicken slaughter rescue. I've got a lot of work to do. I've gotta get off the camera and go get some more bins, get them properly set up, get some of these guys out of here. So guys, hope you enjoyed today's video. If you guys enjoyed today's video, please make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Comment down below a squad name and a prayer for these guys because they have definitely not been given the right care that they need. Hopefully we'll get them back on track and guys, if you're not subscribed yet, you want to see how these chickens do, you want to see tigers, lions, turtles, and tortoises, and all kinds of crazy animals, so guys, all you got to do is go right now, hit the subscribe button, tap that little notification bell, and you all be notified whenever I post.